Let's get to the educational story now. A member of parliament for Sunyani East constituency in the Bono region, Kwesi Ameyao Treme, has implored parents to take advantage of the numerous educational interventions to secure a brighter future for their children. At the inauguration of three different classroom blocks with ancillary facilities at Adidese, Etiahenikrum and Abasim, uh, the member of parliament said many opportunities abounded and that it was uh, through education that societal problems could be solved. He said his desire as a politician was to ease the challenges of his people. Regional correspondent Precious Semeville reports. Farming and deprived communities continue to lag in many infrastructural developments in the Sunyani municipality. And education infrastructure is no exception as pupils as young as five trek miles to assess education in nearby communities. To bridge the gap and make education accessible to all children of school-going age, irrespective of their location, the Member of Parliament for Sunyani East constituency, Kwesiami Acheme, has provided a two-unit KG block with four-seater, WC, an office and a reservoir each at a DDRC and a Tuahini Chrome, and a six-unit classroom block with ancillary facilities at Abisim Presby Primary School. At the inauguration ceremony, Jasehini of a DDRC, Nana Kwesi Donko, underscored the importance of a school in their community, adding it will encourage children to attend school since they wouldn't have to walk for long distances. We have about 100 children in these communities who walk over three miles to attend school at a Tuahini Chrome, so most of them only attend school once in a week, while those below the age six do not even go to school due to the distance. But now that we have a school thanks to Kwesi Amiya Chemi, our bedding will reduce and our three-year-olds will all attend school to acquire knowledge. We also appeal to government to fix our roads to enable those in communities beyond us to assess education here. The Sunyani Municipal Education Director Theresa Trebuache appealed to the